back to CTN. I'm your host, Robert Van Sluten. Let's talk about view controllers. I'm going to give you some quasi-academic statements and sort of explain them along the way. Navigation controller is a container view controller. In other words, it displays the content rendered by other view controllers with some overall management. Now, this particular one manages hierarchical content. And hierarchy is levels. You can go down levels. A tree or a list of things, for example. This will become clearer as we go along. The view control, the, it contains a navigation bar at the top. And you've seen those. They tend to have a title and a button. And an optional toolbar at the bottom, which isn't really all that important. It manages the currently displayed screen via a navigation stack. So in other words, you can go down another level, another level, and you can come back up the levels. You can go down the hierarchy and back up the hierarchy. Well, what is this hierarchy? The navigation stack is implemented as an array of view controllers. So what you're doing is you're navigating through various view controllers. Let's go to an example. So what does this all mean? Well, in the simulator, let's go into settings. I actually have a navigation bar up here. It doesn't look like one, it just looks like a title, but it is a navigation bar. I basically have a table here that's grouped inside a navigation controller. Let's hit general. Well, I've gone further down the hierarchy. Let's go to about. I've gone even further. I now have a back button. I'll go back to general. I can go back to settings. So I'm navigating a hierarchy of information and control via a navigation controller. Okay, let's go over to Xcode and we're actually going to build something with writing absolutely no code. What I have is a single view iPhone application. I'm going to go over to view controllers and I'm going to drag in a navigation controller. What this is, is a container, the navigation controller, containing a table view controller. The table is what's used to select what's in the hierarchy. You can open up the document outline. You can take a look what's in here. I'm simply going to take the arrow. I'm going to move it over to the navigation controller. So that's where the application is going to start. I'm now going to magnify this. I'm going to grab a label. I'm going to drop it in the view controller we got by default, or in the view, in the view controller we got by default. I'm simply going to change the text to hello. I'm now going to go over to the table view that's in this table view controller. And in the attribute inspector, I'm going to change that to static cells. I take a label and I'm going to pull it into, let's say, the first cell.
Oops. Way over there. That's better. And let's call that greeting. Change the text. I'm going to select this cell and I'm going to control drag from it to this view controller. And I'm going to say push. I'm going to go ahead and build and run. Take a little bit of time. It's always slower the first time because the builds are incremental. Plus, I'm also running quick time. I'm going to tap in the cell. I get my view controller that says hello. And I go back. That's the end of the introduction. We're going to be doing more of this in the future. Let's wrap up. A little bit more underwater photography. Thanks for watching.